going on everybody this is jt welcome back to need my garage time tonight i got an unboxing video for you guys a 69 camaro convertible level two kit by reveal this kit was issued back in 1999 so it does have some age on it before i get started i want to give a shout out to all my family and friends back home uh let's sub to my channel and, and viewing uh, I also want to give a shout out to all my new subscribers. I have I got a quite a bit and I really appreciate all y'all supporting my channel So with that being said, let's get into this box Oh, I ain't open it. Let me open it y'all Yeah, who wants to go through all that noise racking with the um, with the um, that, that paper all right y'all so my assistant isn't with me tonight she's in bed sleeping because it's a school night so this video feel kind of weird during the unboxing video but i'm a baby out here with me but let's get into it so first we got this uh camaro convertible they call it the burt these days burt so it's pretty much the same as the uh, hard top, except um, here it looks like it has. Uh, let me see. It's got three ninety five molded into the fender here, and the marker lights they are molded in there too. I don't think they're. Uh, I think. They're molded different. Um, these are molded. You can feel it on the other ones. They are not. Yeah, so that's a difference already. And we got Camaro SS here. And the hard top doesn't have that. Got the marker lights in the back. Now, the back seem to look the same. It just has SS here. And the front is basically the same. All right. Let's take a look at the interior. So I believe the interior is different. Um, I don't even have one of those cars I have to look at. Got the um, clutch accelerator and brake, and it's like an e brake over here on the end. Got our drive shaft shocks and uh, part of your front suspension here. You got a ring in here and front end. You got your fan straw radiator. Back of your front seats right here. All right, so we got, man, I done, I done built, the thing about it is I done built this uh, Camaro a couple of times, the hard top. I can't remember, yeah, I'm guessing, yeah, it's the same thing, it's the same chassis. You got your engine cradle here. There's your front seats. I don't remember if the front seats look the same or not. Here is your boot for your convertible. There's your boot. And we got some A frames here and this will be a radiator uh, support for the bottom up. Well no. That's where the engine sits. So that's the engine cradle. So what was I looking at here? 
basically the same thing because I think the engine sits right there too. But it already has a cross member for the transmission in it. All right. So it does still give you the two tail light options. Let's see. If you look at the one at the top, it has lines in it, and this one doesn't. So that's the difference in it. All right, so you got wheel backs, you got a battery, the steering column. Um, what is this? Let's see. Oh, that, that's your steering box, your steering box right here. That's a hood latch here. And you got distributor cap here and a brake reservoir here. Um, you got a starter here. I think the wheel is different. I think on the um, I think on the other one, the wheel is chrome. I think you have your uh, master cylinder here, console. And the dual is out. You got a rear bumper here. There's not much change uh, between that and the. Uh, so this one has two different wheel options with it. So here you cylinder heads, and you got a two piece of. Uh, you got a two piece of uh, header set. And this seems to be a cooling hose and a cooling hose, and this is for your uh, your breather base, your base for your breather. You got a, a fan and pulley assembly, a better pulley assembly with the fan. Here's your other your other wheel. I guess it's supposed to be a stock wheel, and the other one's supposed to be like a sport wheel or what or whatnot. All right, there's the engine. Engine has with the transmission attached to it. Got a water pump here. And we have our intake here. So on the other one, on the Z28, it has the on the 69 Z28, the engine setup is a little bit different because it has uh, dual carbs on it. We got a different intake. I, I haven't got to the chrome tree yet, so we'll see. All right, so you got your firewall. There's your wrist spoiler, red right added support, rear lead springs. Uh, the door panels are different. The door panels on this car is different than the uh, Z28. Hard top. Door panels are definitely different. Because you have uh so this one has electric windows on the Z28 hard top doesn't have electric windows. This car has electric windows. There's the electric switches for the rear, for the front. Uh there's a door handle. And it also has Camaro motoring in right here. And whatever this is here, that's extra. That other one don't have that. It has the speaker here, but it doesn't. The door panel is totally different. I don't know what this is. It almost looks like a flag right here. <laughs> Probably is. We'll find out here in a minute. Oh, we got some chrome, chrome trees. All right, so 
We got that front bumper, and this one does not give you two different bumper options. I mean, grill options. The other one gives you two different grill options. So, uh, and what might this be? I don't know what I don't know what these are. It's four of them, whatever they are. But there's your grill. There's your valve covers, and there's your seven rally wheels with a breather uh, breather cap. Um, let's see. I believe these may be for the fog lights at the bottom. You got an alternator here. You got the front and the rear bumper here. Gear shifter. These are for your tail lights. Press them off in there and then you see the tail lights in it. License plate, Jiggy Minagis, or whatever you want to call it. Rear view mirror, I mean, side mirror, rear view mirror. Uh, let's see. So you got your single four bar car. You got a. Uh, let's see. It's a, it's a two piece. Uh, this one sets on top of here, I uh, think. Uh, well, this was this one. This one sets on top of here, and this sits on the intake. And we got some door handles. Our door handle. That's something else different. The other one does not come with door handles. The Z twenty eight hardtop does not come with door handles. But the wheels are the same. All right, so we have uh, let me look this here. I was just trying to make sure we don't pain with the. Uh, I was trying to make sure it on the pain with the uh, one grill. So there's your power light uh, lenses and your front windshield with the visors. And here's your rear window. And you also have some other lights here. This for the, let's see something. Because those same lights came in the other kit. And it shows that they're supposed to go down here in the, in the rear bumper, but they never have no holes cut for them. But it shows that in the instructions are also on the on the uh, hard top as well. So I don't know what's the deal with that. All right. So uh, our dashboard here, the dashboard seems to be the same, I believe. I think. And here's your hood. I got a couple more pieces and fell out in here. Let's see what, let's see what these are pieces are about here. Look like look like they gave us a spare piece here. I have no idea what that is. I find out something to do with it. And you got a real spoiler here. Now, I thought I've already came across that. Let's see. Let's see what it, what it is. Was it this? Yep. I believe it was this. So this is not the wrist ball. I'm sorry, guys. This is for uh, the bottom. It's a front spoiler that goes at the that goes at the front at the bottom underneath the bunker. That's what that is. All right. So let's look at the rubber the rubbers, and we have a set of Goodyear tires here. With a little simple tread on it, I need to I need to find a marker or something, a gel pen or something that I can use to where I can start using the tires that has letters on it. That way, I can color the letters in. I can paint the letters, should I say? You uh, know, I ain't got to keep putting them tires to the side. Uh, let's see. Let's look at the decal sheet right here. All right, so I'm guessing this is for the seeding. And this says, 
I thought it said something on there, but it doesn't. So I'm, I'm guessing these are for the front and rear seats. We got some white decals here with the white pinstripe to go down the side. And the same here, black. So they give you two different um, decal options. You can do the hood and trunk, the riders on the hood and trunk, or you can do um, or you can do these two. We got some Camaro SS. We got California plates, California plates. We have uh, gauges here. So this decal sheet is different, way different. Come with an extra set of uh, decals. All right, y'all, my battery is going low on my phone, so I'm going to. Just look through this right quick. This is a, um, let's see how many steps is there. It's an eight step. It's an eight step deal. I tell you what, since my battery is going low, I'm not going to go through the instructions because the instructions is almost the same uh, as the other one. So I'm not going to go, I'm not going to go uh, through that. Go through the instruction. But uh yeah, so all right, y'all. So that's a look at that. That old kit. The paper on the steel smells new. All right, y'all. So that's it. That's all. Uh I might do an update on the GTO tomorrow because um I sprayed the clear on it and I also chromed out the bottom so I'm going to give you guys a look at that tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. And that will be the last update. I will not update again probably until I'm done with it. So I've done, I think, three or four update update videos of it. So I'm going to do this update. And then that's going to be it. So y'all won't see it again until it's completely finished. And I'm almost there with it, okay? So... All right, y'all, so my phone went dead and everything went down. I do not have on the mic now, so the audio will be lower. But I want to tell you guys to go down in the description below. Click the link to hoppingupmodels.com. Go in there and get you some paint, supplies, a new kit. Whatever it is you need, Mark has it, uh, all for reasonable prices. Check out the clearance tab uh, that he have. It's, I think it's a used tab on there as well. So y'all go check out Mark and see what he got for you. All right, so I want to also invite you guys out to our hams meeting, the Houston Automotive Model Society, every second Friday of the month. Come out, bring your kit so you can do a show and tell. Bring a, I mean, you can bring a kit or a model. Uh, you can do a show and tell. We would love to hear your story. We would love to see your, your model that you have built or whatever. If it's a model that you're building, if it's not completed, whatever, bring it. If you want to talk about it, bring it. We would love to see it. Uh, and you know, we have other people doing show and tell as well, uh, showing off kits and you know, whatever it is that they have, uh, you'll have fun. So yeah, come out and join us. That, uh, address and everything will be in, the, uh, will be in the link, uh, in the description. And if you have any other questions about that, just go ahead and email me. My email will be in the description. I can answer any question that you, that you need to know. I can give you, I, I'll tell you what I know. So, uh, yeah, y'all yeah, do that. And uh, tomorrow I'm going to give you guys another update. Like I said earlier in the other video, I'm going to give you guys an update on the GTO tomorrow. I sprayed it with clear. Uh, I still have to do some details to it. I'm waiting on some parts to come in the mail for it. So uh, I'm slow rolling right now. I may go ahead and start on my next project, which will be the 85 Open Bill 442. Uh, that one will be built for, uh, for the Challenge Year Anniversary. And I also have another kit that I want to start on uh, and get it out the way. Uh, it's kind of personal, so I need to start on that kit and, and get it out the way. Um, so, yeah. All right, y'all. That's it and that's all. And I'm out.